here in front. All right. It was built in 1988, asphalt shingles, surrounded by these trees. siding got a really old unit maybe two really old compressors so they're probably original can't be new that's for sure wow there's a little pond back here Got a little fire pit built in, it's pretty nice. Good day for that hammock for sure. I can tell they get, I mean they've cleaned the yard up, but they get a ton of pine needles in this yard. There's no grass growing, it's in the shade. Drops down into this little ravine, moshy area. No water in there now, but I'm sure that probably gets a little water. So you've got bigger pine trees back here. I mean, it's lined up with trees to the right of the, on my right side, facing the back on the left side, and you've got trees lined up back here, surrounded by trees. So a lot of shade. But like I said, a lot of pine needles. Got the deck here. Don't see anything troubling on this wrap. I mean, the siding looks decent. Probably could use a pressure wash. It's normal though. It's on a slab. So there's no. This is the irrigation system being sold in with the house as is. So they don't know if it works or not. They haven't really used it. Um, there's a lift here in this sidewalk. So it goes uphill and then downhill. Notice that when I walked up the first time. So, it literally steps down and back up again. All right. So living here and they are here till the end of June. So they would be very similar to the other situation um, that we're currently got an offer out for. So as you walk in, high ceiling, vaulted ceiling here in the front. There's no overhead light in here, but it has natural light. It's a step down as you come in. So that nice big bay window there. But this is lamp lit in here. You walk through here, we've got dining, formal dining areas. Popcorn ceiling. Only thing with popcorn ceiling is if you have a repair, they're very hard to match up afterwards. Straight into the kitchen. space. We've got a uh, sliding door here. Some space for a, a little round table, if you will, but I mean, you're not getting anything much bigger than that in here. All right, so the washer and dryer are just off of the kitchen. This is likely a pantry. Original cabinets. They just changed the hardware on them. A 
opens up to a nice great room, which is nice. Overhead lights. Gas fireplace. Project. Gonna like it. Ceramic floor. Looks like a newer vanity. Kitchen sink. I mean, not bathroom sink. One of these is a bathroom. I mean, one of these is a closet, and one is a. Closet, and this is going to be the entrance to the garage, I take it. So, as you come in, we've got it's a two car, it's not a huge two car, so one door. Of course, they've got their stuff in here stored. Side exit, so yeah, you can get two cars in here. Got some shelving for our storage on one side, a little shelving there. Water heater is lifted, that's good. Like I said, I think this furnace or this AC unit is probably older. Just looking at the compressors. Going up. So all the bedrooms are upstairs. They're carpeted on the stairwell. And it looks like they've got a, a vinyl plank down in the hallway. So we're going to go straight upstairs to the right is the owner suite. The center of the room is vaulted. Facing the road. Massive room. 2,200 square feet, four bedroom, two bath. Lots of closets. Separates here from the bathroom. So we've got a vanity, makeup area. And we got another vanity. Soaking tub is separated from the shower. And it's a jetted tub. Vaulted ceiling with a skylight. Looking over the backyard, it's pretty nice. And of course the toilet. Charlotte. So the closets got the mirrors on them. I don't really like opening people's stuff, but I'll show you the size of the closets at least. In the Navy or Air Force, I'm sorry. Okay, it's a massive room. Kind of give you an idea. I'm standing at the door with my feet. Vast. I like how they got their little office space there. Okay. Across the way, you got a double door entry to this bedroom. Interesting. Not a huge room, though. Closet's open for us so we can see, but I'm going to stand in the corner as far as I can go. small it's just not huge all right open up against this uh and up into this hallway you can look down on the visitors and back into so it's a two and a half bath two and a half bath so here's the hallway bath another skylight don't need lights on i mean this is every light's off in this house almost All right, and we have two more bedrooms. 
always pretty wide. So this is the entryway. These are the two smaller rooms from my vantage point. Looks over the backyard, decent sized closet. You have pull down access. And then this is pretty much the same size as the last room. We're using it as a nursery. Overhead light works in here. So we got fans in bedrooms. This house is listed at 320,000. We'll get a ton of offers. They all have been. Um, four bedroom, two and a half bath on a slab. I'll send this video to you. Let me know what you think. Oh, offers will be presented tomorrow morning.